morning, my guy. What's up, guys? How are you? Oh, it's not that cold out here. No, it's actually kind of nice. It is. I think this is the last nice day. You know why? It's snowing on Friday. It might snow on Friday. Katie and I won't be here on Friday, so if it snows, you have to vlog it for me, okay? I definitely. Yes. All right. And I'll post on Insta. Oh, really? If you're not already following me on Insta, it's Ryan Donnelly. Go follow me. Yeah. Very good. Keep up with what Ryan's doing on the daily basis. All right, have a great day at school today. It's Tuesday. Today's plus period. Where are you gonna go for plus period today? Uh, I don't know. I think, I think we have six period. Six period? Okay. Yeah, oh, and I, just so you know, I just aced my social studies test system. Kinda aced it, but you know. Congratulations, that makes me proud of you. So I probably have some more in the high 80s. Okay, uh, have a great day, love you. Love you too. All right, guys, so the only thing that's really getting me through the week right now is the fact that me and my mother, which is up there, we are going to a mystery destination on Friday. So if you guys want to find out what the mystery destina destination is, you have to wait till the end of this video, and then we'll tell you. Okay, I have to go to school now, so bye. Yeet. Ruff, 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 ruff. So Mike and I are out doing errands. One of those errands is returning Tucker's vocals. So if you can recall, um, Tucker and his family were here for Thanksgiving and they accidentally left the bowls and we're just getting around to returning them. I had to take the food out. Anyway. Okay, I think Tucker's gonna be happy. Yes, finally he's good to eat again. I hope he's been eating. <laughs> you think he's been eating? He has to eat off the floor. Yeah, it's been two weeks. Yes, he's got a drink out of a glass. Right, <laughs> exactly. He's thinned up a bit. <laughs> All right, we got the car clean. I'm gonna have to lunch with my friend. We said, Tucker, you got some stuff for the giving tree at church. What else? Can we go, can we go home now? Sure. Get all of our, all of our errands. Fantastic. Now I'm figuring out what's going to happen this weekend because Katie and I are not going to be here. Where are you going? It's a surprise. What? What are we? What are the boys gonna do? I don't know. <gasps> you'll probably watch some football. Maybe you'll go to the Christmas party at the church. I did not I approve know. that. Mm, yes, you did. Oh. Uh -uh. We're gonna surprise everybody at the end of the video with where we're gonna be. When are you leaving? Friday morning, because Katie doesn't have school. And originally she was gonna have a gymnastics meet this weekend, but when she broke her arm, we were like, woo, we had been looking for a weekend that we could go to this place where we're going. And when she broke her arm, we're like, well, she's not gonna be competing in the meet. And she doesn't have school on Friday, so let's go. So we're going. Very exciting. It is very exciting. Does it involve a plane, a train, or an automobile? A plane, an airplane. Ooh, you're flying somewhere? We are. A little far away. Far away? Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Argentina. Seeing someone we haven't seen in a very long time. It's not Argentina. Oh, are you going to see friends? Yes. Cool. Yes. It's going to be very fun. All right. Looking forward to it. Yes, I am. What's up, guys? So, uh, as you can see, we're walking right now. Where are we walking? In the road. Where are we walking <laughs> again? To in Through our neighborhood to our house. So, you may be like, why are you walking to your house through the neighborhood on the road, Ryan? And I'm saying to you that, yeah, I know, right? My fucking skills are amazing. So I'm saying to you guys that, uh, so there was a tractor trailer delivering something to a house down here, and they had to get out, and it's a huge tractor trailer, and they were trying to get out, and, yeah. and the police, this there were like two police there, and then our police, our, our bus couldn't pass it. Drop our bus driver dropped us off at CVS, yeah, and now we're walking home. And so now we're walking home. home. So, well, yeah, like people did. have to walk to the other neighborhood. Yeah, some people have to walk like really far. Which, uh, I mean, I don't really have to walk that far, but it's, I mean, it's not bad. So, we're trucking it. And me and Charlie are going to the Y. Why? Because we go there every Tuesday the to walk. work out. Yeah, because yeah, it's the there. Y. The lift, bro. Oh, yeah, bro. You we lift. lift. Oh, yeah, we lift? lift. Oh, yeah, we lift. Oh, cool. How much yeah. you lift? How much oh, you lift? Yeah. Like, uh, Fiddy's Hondas. You, you lift like you 300 know. pounds. Oh yeah, I got the 300 pound dumbbells. Yeah. yeah. And yes. about five million setups. Oh, where's the most? So, yes, a small workout. What's up guys? Me and Drew and Layla are at McDonald's eating some fries because there was a tractor trailer that got stuck in our neighborhood on the road so we couldn't get by. And so the bus just dropped us off at the CVS. So we walked across the street and now we're at McDonald's eating some fries. Because that's all I could afford because I ate a <laughs> chunk of deodorant and I got $5. Put that in there. We had a chunk of deodorant and got five dollars. But what? Alex, it was only like this big. Like that's a pretty big chunk of deodorant. Eight. Oh, 
we're gonna eat these Hello. fries and we'll see you guys later. Guess what I'm doing, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Gross, actually, those are bananas. Those are those old bananas that we have that make the best banana bread. They have gotten so old and brown that they're now really, really mushy and really, really sweet. So you mix that with some sugar and some eggs and then do flour and baking soda and everything over there. And we put a little walnuts in it. It's gonna be the best banana bread ever. Just don't tell the kids I took the bananas out of the garbage. Shh. Hello. Hi, Brennan. Who are you writing to? Uh, I'll protect their privacy. They're here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Have a great practice. Thank you. Love you, bye. Well, that was that. I was a little skeptical. But? Because those bananas were, what, 17, 18 months old? Maybe, but they were still good. Wow. Can you tell me what you think? Do you like the end piece, which you call, like to call the heel? I don't call it the heel, you call it the heel. Oh, would you like the heel? <laughs> Comment below, what do you call the end of the bread? Do you call it the heel or do you call it the end piece? It's okay. called the end piece. Um, that looks fantastic. Okay. Well so, done. Man. Thank you. Which do you prefer? Um, both. Inside? Okay. Try this. Do you want butter on it? Yes, please. Okay. That's great. Let me know what you think. Well done. Still I was skeptical. I apologize. Nice work. Thank you. Oh, this is what happened when we took the stuff out of the shed. All this stuff has to go somewhere. Now, this is my question. I have albums. Journey, Escape. <laughs> what are you laughing at? The Jacksons. Terrence Trent Darby. Ugh. Phil Collins. You guys, what do you do with your albums? The Grateful Dead. I think my brother what gave that to me. Annie. Yeah, Annie has some albums. This was one of my favorites. This is called Music Appreciation. There's right, like right. eight, eight, look at like tons of albums there. Annie? I used to, this is how I know it. all of my classical music. <laughs> No, that this one's is good. Sheila E. Soul to Soul. Keep on oh, Michael Jackson. K pop. Jackson 5. Yes, it is a bunch of soul, but it's the real. Look at Janet Jackson. That is a classic right there. Wham. Classic. UTFO. Classic. I don't remember what that stood for. Okay, I think that's enough. Charday. Come on, come on. The Daz There's Band. Like 20 more that they're going to die. Let's see. Look at Soft Cell. Oh. Prince in the Revolution. I should already skip it. They don't know that. They Cat Stevens, Ready for the Cat World. Stevens. My sister and I have a funny story about Ready for the World. One year, our family went to Walt Disney World for um, New Year's Eve. Mm -hmm. And you know there's five kids. So it was five of us and my mom and my dad. And we were at Epcot on New Year's. And Ready for the World was there. And they sang, oh, oh, Sheila. And we went to watch it, my sister and I. And I couldn't see. And I was probably, I don't know, 14. And I got on her shoulders. <laughs> Just being like, oh, I was on her shoulders and she was going like this. We were trying to watch. It was very funny. So, like Cosby, Sills, and Nash, John Cougar, Mellencamp, and Starpoint. That, my friend, is an album collection. But I cannot get rid of them. I absolutely can't. So instead, I'm going to ask for a um, a turntable, or I'm going to go buy a turntable. I'm happy today was buying. Uh, I mean, doing some um, getting my homework done. Your homework done? Yeah. The Good. reason I stayed out here to watch all your albums is so I could think. Think about what made you happy today. <laughs> Do you know any of my albums? Do you want to see any of them? Well, listen. I actually have to pass. Okay. Some of them have I the words in them. We can sure. listen to them together when I get a turntable. Good night, sweet dreams. I love you. Bye. What are you doing there, rag guy? Watching some NHL. NHL? Who's playing? The Minnesota Wild and the LA Kings. Fantastical. Who are you rooting for? I don't know. Yeah? I like the Capitals, so. Okay. What's your favorite thing you did today? Huh. Probably go to the Y. Tell everybody where you did your homework tonight. In your closet. Yeah. That was awesome. Seeing, like, I, I don't know what I was doing in my closet, but I checked my closet or something. And I figured out there was a huge open space behind there. So I sat in there and I found there was an outlet. Because, like, I could put my phone in here. There's an outlet inside your closet? Yeah. Really? There's a whole, like, a lot of space back there. And then I just, like, sat in there and did my homework. Because I was too lazy to go out. <laughs> Seems like a pretty cool. We, you could make that into like a fort. Why don't you do that? Okay. Let's do that. Let's make it into a fort. What do you need? Let me know what you need for it, okay? That'd be really cool. All right. Okay. I love it. Sounds good. All right. Yo, I could sleep there. Toads. Honestly, it's so spacious in there. Okay. Well, maybe not for you, but for me. Yes. Probably, definitely not for me. I. Okay. I'd like it's to actually keep it so cool. Though. Maybe you can give us a tour one day. All right. We'll dude it up. We can put yeah. a light in there and everything if you want. 
Good. Yeah. That'd be awesome. Yeah. A little stove. So you never ever had to come out. Yeah. You could just stay right like... in there. And you can drill a hole to the bathroom because it's connected to the bathroom. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that would be so Yo, cool. that's like my own mini house. Shh, don't tell anybody. No. Katie's editing. Oh my gosh, Katie's editing. I know. Uh, Isn't that exciting? Yo, watch. The, what are we going to name that video? The Probably the Christmas, Christmas Wish List 2017. Christmas Wish List 2017 video. Coming out in a couple days. And you'll see Katie's beautiful editing. Fantastic. Edited video. Second. Oh, well, well, uh, sec oh, wait, what, what was the first She did one called Katie's Confessions. Did you ever see that? We'll put a uh, link to it, right? Bing. There. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I love doing that. Just like a virtual video. Boom. Hey, what made you happy today? I'm going to say finding my like little house in the closet. Uh-huh. And um, going to the wild with Charlie was fun. Good. We played basketball for a um, like 30, 40 Can minutes. I undo something? It was really say. fun. Uh huh. Good job, my guy. No, yeah. I, okay. Okay. Can I see James? I love you. And she was love you too. Thanks. So, Charlie had these like riddle cards in the car that we tried to solve some of them. And this one was super hard. Me and Charlie were trying to figure it out, but we just couldn't. It was so hard. Try to it, comment below the answer. The day before, two days after, the day before tomorrow is Monday. What's today? I repeat. <laughs> the day before, two days after, the day before tomorrow is Monday. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. All right, wait, wait. Now pause your video right now. Okay. Go back and see what I just said and try to figure it out. Okay. What's up, fellas? Um, what made me happy today? Look at these sheets. Look at those gosh darn sheets. So dang adorable. What made me happy today was Today was a really boring Tuesday because, oh, actually, made me happy today was the tractor trailer that was stuck in the middle of the road, which made our bus have to drop us off at McDonald's. That was some good stuff. So comment below, made you guys happy today, and we'll see you guys manana. What's poppin', ladies and gentlemen? I know what you're thinking. It's daytime, <laughs> and the last clip, it was nighttime. And actually, where we live, Nighttime only lasts like five minutes. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, the real reason that I'm talking to you guys right now is because we, yesterday is the video that you're watching now in real life. So, yesterday, which is what you guys are watching right now, we forgot to tell you guys where we're going on Friday and Saturday and Sunday. So, we are going to tell you now because we forgot to do it in the last video. So, where are we going, Mom? We are going to Utah to visit Coach Kimmy and baby Scotty. Is that you? Woo! And Dan. And Dan. Yes, and Dan, of course, and Dan. So, but this time, instead of going to Southern Utah, we're going to Salt Lake City. Very excited about Salt Lake City. And um, so we're gonna go out there and visit them and do Christmassy stuff and meet baby Scotty. And so, do Christmassy stuff. Do Christmassy stuff. So when Kate, Kate was supposed to have a gymnastics meet this weekend and her teammates do, but when she broke her arm, um, we were like, whoa, we have the opportunity to go to visit Coach Kim because we've been looking for a weekend that we could do it ever since Scotty was born. And as it turns out, there's no school on Friday, so it's a perfect weekend. So we're leaving early We're supposed to be morning. having like parent teachers conference things, student-led conferences, but I'm very glad that I'm not there do doing that. Okay. And you don't have to. It's like I know. It's not, it's not mandatory, but... So anyway, that's the end of the story. We are going to Utah. We'll be talking about it in future videos. Thanks for watching, us. for sticking along the whole video. And if you're watching this video today, which is Friday, we are on a plane on the way there right now. See you later. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.